Hello and welcome to another Icovia instructional video. This is Chris and today I'll be walking you through adding a pattern and a color to surface areas and icons so that you can breathe some life into your typically black and white plan. First we'll start with a basic room and I'll use the default dimensions of 24 by 16 feet and we'll select create a new plan. Now when the plan loads you'll notice that there are the four walls we've selected and a gray surface area that appears between them by default. You can left click once on this surface area to bring up the surface area menu. This menu will let you clone, separate the surface area from the walls if you need to move it, or delete it. You can also change the transparency of the pattern that we're about to add. On the bottom right you'll notice two little color swatches. The first is blank in its color, the second has a red line through it and this indicates the pattern. Let's left click once on the pattern to bring up the patterns menu. You'll notice in here that we've got several types of hardwood, several types and colors of carpet, several patterns of tiling, and a few outdoor surfaces like water, grass, loose gravel, and pavement. Let's come back up to the top and we'll start with a hardwood pattern. Now there are a few things you could do once you've added a pattern. You can change the scale up or down to increase the size of the pattern. I'll bring it up to 160 so that we've brought our slats up to a more a larger size and then you can select to rotate the pattern I'll choose to do that by about 45 degrees allow color change is selected by default which means that you can come up here to the colors tab click it once and either use a default color that we've got selected for you or click into the advanced menu the advanced menu will let you select a different hue here on the right hand side or a different color itself by clicking and dragging the little bubble you see here. Let's try to aim for a darker kind of cherry color just like this. Once you've done that we can X out of this menu. Now we're going to add a few icons to the plan and color them. First we'll start with the contemporary sofa and then we'll add uh, the matching love seat. We'll kind of get these in position and then we'll click on the sofa. Now from the sofa menu you'll notice at the top right we've got a little color swatch just like we did for the surface area. Let's click that once and it'll bring up the same advanced menu. You can switch back to basic if you need or back to advanced where we'll start. Let's try to find a kind of a black leather color. So once we've found that we can select all of the text in the hex field, right click, copy it. Now we can come over to our love seat, open up the color menu one more time, select everything in this hex field, and right click, paste. And now we've actually taken the color from the sofa and added it to the love seat. So now that the colors are exactly matching. You can use colors and patterns on the, on the surface areas and use colors on any of the icons that you can add to Icovia. Hopefully this will help you breathe some life into a typically black and white plan to really wow a client of yours. This has been another Icovia instructional video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.